It is often said that when a man works diligently in his business, he shall stand before kings. He shall not stand before ordinary people. This is the case of Teju Uyelaki, popularly known as Teju Babyface, an embodiment of talent and creativity, and one of Nigeria's finest, youngest, and cutest stand up comedians. A man many describe as talented, hard working, intelligent, and focused. Little wonder, friends, well wishes, and well meaning Nigerians turned out in their numbers to identify with him at the official launch of his book. 23 Secrets for Achieving Success with Talent, which was held at the Moson Center, Unicorn, Lagos, on Friday, 19th May 2017. It was indeed a gathering of top notch comedians, as well as high profile personalities from different works of life, among whom were publisher of Ovation Magazine, Chief Dili Momodu, Senior Pastor Daystar Christian Center, Pastor Sam Adeyemi, popular founder of Terra Culture. Bolali Austin Peters, the producer of the Teju Babyface show, Tadeo Guidon, top talk show host and CEO Rave TV, Agatha Amata, Professor Pat Utomi. The event witnessed a huge turnout of fellow comedians who came out in their numbers to support their own. They include veteran comedian Basaj Taria Jr., T.A. Kofi, Julius Agu, Lepasha's Bosse. Also in attendance was representative of the Governor of Lagos State, Mr. Fola Adeyemi, Permanent Secretary, Ministry of Information and Strategy. Born in Lagos, Nigeria in 1979, Teju Uyelaki attended Corona School Apapa, Federal Government College of Bumosho, and the University of Lagos, where he bagged a bachelor's degree in insurance. Teju's first foray into entertainment was as a member of the Theatre 15, a vocational acting group made up of other students while he was in the university. Teju started out as an actor, but ended up a successful stand-up comedian, political satirist, inspirational speaker, talk show host, master of ceremony, television producer, and widely known as the creator and host of the Teju Babyface Show a talk show that showcases the best elements of the African society. Teju Babyface is multi-talented and has bagged several awards, some of which include Wedding Planner Wedding MC of the Year 2009, African Audiovisual Awards as Most Outstanding TV Talk Show Director 2010, Bold Inspiration Awards as Inspiring Television Program 2010, Ninja Awards Best Comedy Show 2010, Mood Men Magazine, TV Personality of the Year 2012, City People Awards, Male Achiever of the Year 2012, Nigerian Broadcast Merit Awards, TV Program of the Year 2012, Success Digest Enterprise Awards, Certificate of Honor, Creative Business of the Year 2012, among others. The Chief Presenter of the Day, Pastor Sam Adeyemi, dedicated the book to the glory of God and blessing of humanity. He commended the author for putting together such a compendium of knowledge. He also described him as a multi-talented, creative and focused young man. It was then time for the mentors of the celebrant to give their testimonies. When I wanted to be a comedian in school, and nobody would give me an opportunity because I looked too young, and then I looked too Ajibotarish, and then I was too tush because I went to Corona and I wasn't speaking pigeon and you know I didn't do all the pigeon things I wasn't from the Niger Delta he saw me when he was introduced to me and he said I like you you, you carry something called pedigree and that pedigree will take you very very far first to take the stage was veteran comedian Basaj Taria Jr who has been described by Teju Babyface as his first mentor one who believed in him when others brushed him aside. Basaj Taria Jr. in his speech said, Teju Babyface did not grow up in the street, but the street embraced him, further describing him as a humble and articulate entertainer, an intelligent comedian who has the right punchline to crack up his audience while performing. As said earlier in this book, GSM phones were still at least two years away. For the world to do 
For most folks, those phones were five years away at the point in early 2000. In C.S. Lewis' book, The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe, there were two types of magic on display. Deep magic from the dawn of time, which saw Aslan, the king, killed, and then deeper magic from before the dawn of time, which saw the same lion come back to life. The folks that live near the butter we are at least partially correct. So if the fact that Basorge wasn't at home was deep magic, deeper magic was that as we turned to leave, he chose that moment to return and stroll through the gate of his house. That elicited a feeling of pure delight. And at the same time, trepidations that is hard to capture here. That we are role models and we influence largely the younger ones must not influence them in affluence, in what we have or what we have, we have become. We must not celebrate fame, but we must celebrate the success of our knowledge, of our platform to teach. Teju has become a teacher. He's invited me to also become a teacher. As a mentor, I think I automatically, automatically qualify to become a teacher in the school. In the remarks of the Lagos State Governor, Mr. Akiwumi Ambode, who was represented by the Permanent Secretary, Ministry of Information and Strategy, Mr. Fola Adeyemi. He commended Teju Babyface's contributions to the entertainment industry. He said, Patience, hard work, focus, and dedication, which are rare qualities to find in people of Teju Babyface's generation, have kept him on the path of success. Teju's achievements are not because of his noble background but his desire to succeed. He commended him for packaging street wisdom into a book. In conclusion, he encouraged the youth to follow his path and pledged the support of the Lagos State Government to distribute copies of the book to all educational institutions across the state. It is my pleasure to join you on this occasion of the public presentation and launch of the book titled Secrets of the Streets by Oye Lakin or Lakin, better known as Teddy Baby's Face. This book, from a little glimpse into its content, represents a major contribution towards shaping the direction of our youth towards achieving success in all spheres of life. It is said that many achieve greatness, while some have greatness just upon them. The success Teddy Baby Face has achieved in the entertainment industry it's not by fact of his noble background, but through hard work, diligence, and determination to succeed. This he has demonstrated over the years through support to the entertainment industry. He has supported various artists in the entertainment industry. He has supported shows across the world. He has promoted one Lagos fiesta, which was actually done in one venue across the whole globe. But now, today, it's been done five and eight days in Nigeria here. Ladies and gentlemen, I commend your effort in packaging street wisdom by Trudy Oyelaki for the uncommon achiever in the book form, which will assist and inspire our talented youth in achieving great success. You can be rest assured of the support of the Lagos State Government towards this publication. I also encourage our youth and even the younger generation to actually follow this path to appreciate this author and everybody that is here today in supporting this great work. Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, it is our pleasure to now say on behalf of the Lagos State Government that we are going to support, not only launch, we are going to support and ensure that these books are purchased and distributed to all our institutions, educational institutions. <laughs> in the author, in his vote of thanks, thanked all who came to support him on the auspicious occasion of the launch of his book. He appreciated his wife, Mrs. Ulua Tony Uyelaki, for encouraging and standing by him through thick and thin. Thank you very much, sir. God bless you. God bless you. Uh, thank you very much. I'm glad to have been here. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, I never would have thanked you. Sorry, I know I said I was going to this was quickly followed by photo sessions. The event was rounded off with a closing prayer 
by Mr. Azu Ishekwene, the former executive director Punch Newspapers. Biscon Communications wishes Teju Babyface success in all his future endeavors. Teju Babyface um, is a down to heart somebody, is a traditional guy, is a pleasant guy, and um, honestly, is very humble. It's amazing that Teju is turning around to help other people to be successful. This thing is passing down the line. This is the fulfillment of the dream. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. What I love about the book is his mentors, he has a got to mention them and he gave them what they deserve there. Give it to him. And he talked about a lot of street things, but the mentorship thing, I love it. Teju is a very bosom friend, we grew up together. Uh, beyond all of this, Teju Babyface show and uh, Secrets of the Streets. Um, what you don't know of the man is his indigenous nature and uh, authentic personality. He doesn't joke with who he naturally is and that is why we're good friends. Teju is my sweetheart. His generation doesn't lack a lot of what he makes him stand out. The first time I met Teju, his humility just blew me. Um, Teju is one of the few people that I know that reads a lot. He's able to internalize things that happen to him and reproduce it in a way that other people can benefit. It's a gift that he has. And I'm glad, like Pastor Adeyemi has said, that he is now using it to mentor and to teach because that itself is a gift. I, I assumed in the beginning that I was going to be like a motivational speaker or something. But nobody was calling me. Every time I sent them letter that they should call me, they say, you know, a comedian. I beg, I beg, I beg. So I had this computer full of messages and nowhere to preach or teach now. So somebody suggested I put it in a book. I said, okay, that's true. So I put some of them in a book. So from the moment I decided to write a book to when the book came out, it was just two months. I had written most of it, actually. You must build structures. You have overheads. You have expenses. You must have a savings account. It's a business. You have to learn the business of the show. That's why it's called show business. So you have to arm yourself with information. Thank <laughs> you.